Hello everyone and welcome to Open Food Facts Producers Platform. My name is Sarazin and today I will show you how to import data via a spreadsheet. In total, four options are available to import product data on the platform. And if you are wondering which one will work best for you, do not hesitate to first watch the video in the link below. Once logged in your Open Food Facts workspace, click on Import Product Data right here or right there. You can then either import an Excel or CSV extraction of your own system or use the spreadsheet model that we provide. You can access it by clicking on Download an XLSX template file for Excel or LibreOffice with the fields that can be imported. In the case you decide to work with our spreadsheet model, once you've downloaded the XLS file, you'll be able to fill in rows and columns with your product's data. And comments are available at the top of each header uh, to help you with data entry. Something that is important to keep in mind is that some fields are more important than others. Indeed, fields such as the category, the ingredients list, and the nutritional information are mandatory for the computation of the Nutri-Score and the Eco-Score. So it is better to prioritize those. Another important point to look out for is the way of importing product photos via the spreadsheet. Beware to not directly insert the photo in the file, as the only way to upload images via a spreadsheet is to paste the link to this image in the corresponding column, so it could be linked to uh, the front product photo and so on. And please make sure that the link is public so that our system can interpret it. Once you've filled in the file with your data, you can click on Upload a file with product data. And after a few seconds, the platform takes you to a page that allows you to check the correspondence uh, between the fields of the file you have just imported and the fields of the Open Food Facts database. If you've been using our template, you can go ahead and select Import Data to import your product data on your private workspace. And if you've been working with your own spreadsheet model, so from your own system, this step is important. Our system will automatically detect some fields and suggest matches, but we still recommend you to take the time to check carefully the suggestions and complete the mapping manually where needed, so that your file can be correctly imported. Finally, upon import of the product data, you can take advantage of many free tools such as the suggestions to improve your products and so on. More about it is in another tutorial in the link below. And there you go! You have just imported data for the first time in Open Food Facts. Thanks again for your commitment towards food transparency. Goodbye.